If we keep talking about um, this decision and building electrification and acting on what we learn together, that means that we're identifying and developing and passing the solutions. If we stop talking about it today or tomorrow, that would mean that there's a chilling effect and the gas industry has won over local health and safety and over global climate well beyond the Berkeley decision. We can't let that happen and we don't need to let that happen. One thing I will say is I would really like local governments to think about layering options, right? Like what a show to, to send to the, the fossil fuel industry that they adopt all three, right? They do a pollution tax, they ban new gas, not fossil fuel piping in the distribution system, and they adopt an uh, um, appliance limit on hot water heaters and furnaces. Three relatively safe approaches that get at different problems. Electrification is um, much better for our community members with the off-gassing from gas in your houses, in your heaters, in your stoves, and all the different health impacts. Um, it is my dear hope that the way that the gas industry is fighting this movement is going to, is, is already ending up spurring creativity in developing policies that they will not be able to stop. I'm hoping that in the end, um, this is, this is the, the place where the tide actually started to turn to just electrifying everything, new construction, existing buildings, keeping in mind those equity concerns which Cheryl raised, all of it.